Here we are in Denali National Park, a very iconic place in Alaska, iconic place in the world, known for its wildlife, alpine tundra, but also it started to become known as a place where buses had traffic jams and the wildlife started to alter their behavior to avoid the road system. Year after year after year, we were seeing less and less wildlife. And then in 2021, the road collapsed because of permafrost melting, a result of climate change. Now that the road is closed, only 1% of all the people that used to get back into the park via buses can actually get back there now. The only way into the back of Denali National Park is by helicopter or by plane. We've chosen to take helicopters and the scenery is ridiculous. And then you get out there 90 miles into the back of the park and biologists are now starting to find out that some of this wildlife is now beginning to come back to the road system and actually use it as a corridor. What's really amazing about that is once you're back there, the wildlife is actually more plentiful and their behavior is more natural and less afraid of people. We were just up there for two days and the amount of wildlife we saw, not only the wildlife we saw, but the behavior they were showing was completely different from what I've seen over the past two decades. We were able to sit and relax with moose grazing in the bottom of Wonder Lake and a beaver coming right up to our feet. That is not something that could be seen for about two decades now. I think this new itinerary is incredibly special for that and I'm really excited for what's to come.